The principal aim of the course is to help leaders at all different levels to improve the quality of other people's teaching. So this course provides strategies about the right type of advice to give to colleagues to improve the quality of their own teaching and to develop a culture of learning across the organisation where year on year teachers improve. So many teachers are cognitively overloaded, or sometimes called processing overload. Many teachers are overwhelmed by the amount of information that they have to consume, and have certainly there's been incredible amount of changes in our industry. Uh, lots of teachers have been taught things previously, or or did things previously that they thought would reward them, but now it's proven to be uh, quite facile in, in, in many respects. The second area is that of relational trust. Uh, many academics, Professor Vivian Robinson in particular, has, has highlighted the importance of creating high trust culture in schools. So when students trust their teacher, when leaders trust uh, teachers, we've got an environment that's proven to have higher student outcomes. So certainly what we'll do in the course is talking about strategies where we can boost relational trust uh, which is a core principle to get in a learning culture uh, developing in the organisation. And thirdly, the other key barrier are perception gaps. We've identified four main perception gaps. Some people perceive that they're more effective than they really are, and perhaps that's through previously doing well under uh, previous Ofsted frameworks where the lesson observation was king, but now we need to look much more extensively at the impact of data, the quality of work in children's books. We've also got some people who, who perceive that they're not as good as they really are uh, and we need to therefore utilise their talents to coach and develop others. There's some colleagues perceive that they can't be much better than they really are now, so that's about tackling some teachers' belief systems. Um, and there's also the sense that um, some perceive that they're more open to learning than they really are. And so what we try to do in this course is offer some frameworks about how we can define both high performance within the context uh, of each person's school and area and also develop uh, a, a shared definition about what adult learning looks like. So the basis for the Learning Imperative book is that we wanted to write a book to share our experience of working not just in education, although that's where we mainly ply our trade, uh, organisations that have attempt and successfully actually develop a, a culture of learning. And when that culture has been developed, there's a proven impact on performance. We offer lots of solutions about how we can pre-assess the starting points of people in your organisation and how to design learning journeys for them that actually they enjoy in, in, in the part. I think enjoyment is really, really important. Too many people don't enjoy coming to work uh, in all sorts of walks of life, but actually mostly that they have an impact over time on the people that they're working with. And in the education context, of course, that they have an increasingly uh, positive impact on the children and young people that they're working with. Total Quality Teaching Across the School is a course that's absolutely aimed at people who need to develop the, the quality of other people's teaching. Of course you'll benefit from coming on this course and think about your own teaching, but if you're in a position of being a senior leader, being a middle leader, being someone in the organisation who is a coach to somebody else, uh, and you want some strategies to have to be more effective in those roles, then I really feel strongly that this course, Total Quality Teaching uh, across the school, is the course for you.